your boy Dave from It's A Pop Thing. Thank you guys for joining me over here on YouTube or whether you check me out on Instagram at It's A Pop Thing, T-H-A-N-G, or you following us over on Facebook at Fanatic Funko. Thank you guys for checking us out while we talk about Funko, we do some hunts, we check, we unbox some mystery minis. We do a little bit of everything on here. I'm gonna start incorporating other um, toys and collectibles that I've seen. You know, of course there might be some Hot Wheels on here, but you know, our focus is always gonna be Funko Pops that I have too many and this is only one half of the room. But anyhow, I hope you guys are having a great pop hunting week. We're getting closer and closer to SDCC. Um, still don't know how they're gonna roll it out, but um, we did some hunting today. We went to Barnes and Noble and, and we went to FYE and I got a everything so I can uh, unboxing to do, a big unboxing. So when we come back, we're gonna start showing you everything we got. Check out where we went, what we saw, and um, try to figure out what we got before the end of the video. Thank you guys, we'll be right back. Okay, we are back. Um, you see, I went to Barnes Noble earlier today and I didn't know that somebody had put on Facebook that, that there was a, a Black Widow Chase. I had already got one, but um, so you've seen while we were there, we did go ahead and pick up uh, the gamer version. And now this is the second one. And in the comments below, tell me what Chase have you found? This is kind of, the box is kind of messed up. Um, what Chase have you found the most of? Um, in um in, in any store whether it's been sorry let's get that out of there whether it's sorry this is too much stuff uh whether it's been like um i know this one i found twice i found the um the jim halpert chase a couple of times last christmas or a couple of christmas ago when the first glow in the dark darth vader came out i think i found five of those that whole season um i seen two two a couple of days ago at a, at a resale store but yeah <laughs> um, so tell me comments about what comment have you what chase have you found the most of i know people would like to find the joker chase uh the american um psycho chase the uh what and what else the one and the texas tornado or terrible tornado tor terrible tornado chase i know what people like to find most of those because they have really raised in value this one's not too much thought i think you can get this um uh 20 bucks maybe um and so i'll just add this to one of our uh mystery box sales down the road because somebody might want this but the the box is kind of i don't know not the best but anyhow that was something we got you know it's always fun to find 
chases in the wild. And as you've seen, when we went to uh, FYE, like the last one was at FYE, they didn't have everything, but they had the, I think it was Abomination Batman. They had a beat up Gambit box. Gambits are still hard to come by. Entertainment Earth is having a problem getting those to everyone, getting to the to the retailers like me. So they've been pushing them back. Uh, same thing with the Batman. Uh, same thing with the, the multicolored Batman. Have never seen that out because Funko's having a problem with getting those in. Um, what else? What else? Where else? Mm, well, we went to, well, we just, we were just at, you see, seeing the Barnes Noble. Oh, and FYE. And then the, the, um, the, the Galaxy Spider-Man that was there. Um, they had the black and white Merlin, Mo Merlin Moreau, um, exclusive. They had, uh, the PX previews, uh, uh, snapped Tony Avengers, Tony Stark, um, pop and then there was another one that i can't remember that was in the video that was like oh that's kind of cool um but anyhow what we got drum roll please we just we sat it on the i hadn't seen this anywhere else and i didn't want to order it so i got this from um fye our store is called coconuts but i am the iron man I am Iris Snap, but yeah, that's pretty cool. So I'm glad to have him finally. Um, it, it, it's been out for, well, it just came, it just released this month. So people, you probably start seeing those in like GameStop and in your local FYE. Last but not least, I did get, can you see what's on there? You can't see it. I did order, now, I a couple weeks ago, it was like Freddy's birthday or something, and they had all, and I'm mad at myself because I should have got more. They had all the 10-inch pops, and I told you I don't don't like it till I 10-inch, but I, I should have got more. Um, all the 10-inch pops on for like, well, se select few for $15. I lost my handy knife, so I don't know what happened to it. So I'm having to open with my pen that I use down here. And that's not working, guys. So if I had my keychain, that would, um, how did that even get down here? I didn't bring it. That's weird. I didn't bring it down here. Hey, this will work. Look at these. These are the tiniest scissors in the world. Where did I even get these scissors at? That's ridiculous. Um, but hey, they're sharp enough to work, to open this box. That's all that matters. And I've been wanting this one, wanted it, wanted it, wanted it. And it came in a shipper, it came um, a sorter, and then it came in a, a, a big box that you've seen. Then I also have this wrapped with a um, bubble wrap. So, let's see if we can get this to come out. Yeah, it's coming out. That's how I'm gonna get. So now that stack over there, I'm going to have to get rid of so I can put this other uh, 10 inch pop there. So what did I get? Do you guys know what I got? It doesn't matter because I'm gonna show you anyhow. We got the 10 inch Funko Shop exclusive. Well, I guess they're all Funko Shop exclusives. Well, maybe not, somewhere Target, but this has a Funko Shop. Um, Captain Crunch, how cool is that? Now, is this the original? I don't know if this is the original, because I have a Captain Crunch that was the Target one, and then there's all the guys that were on the box originally. But there we go, the original Captain Crunch, well, the Captain Crunch 10-inch pop um, that we was able to get from Funko Shop. It took a long time to get here, but um, it's here, and I need to find somewhere to put it now. Anyhow, tell me in, in the comments below if you got any of the 10-inch pops for $15. And um, did you guess right what, what I picked up at uh, Hot Top, Hot Topic, <laughs> FYE and Barnes Noble before you watch the video? Anyhow, thank you guys. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.